science is about finding answers. And how far you'll go to get those answers. That is a quick clip from the new Omni Theater film, Ancient Caves. Joining us today is paleoclimatologist, Dr. Gina Mosley. Good morning, doctor. Hello, good morning. Uh, I can, I would put money on the fact that most people watching today have never heard of a paleoclimatologist, but actually uh, your job is very important, becoming more important in the age of climate change. Can you sort of explain what you do, what a paleoclimatologist does? Yes, yeah, sure. Paleoclimatology is a study of past climate change. So anything before historical records or instrumental record so this can be hundreds of thousands of years and it allows us to put the uh, to understand how the climate system works so we find analogs in the past and we we understand if you warm something up or put more co2 in the atmosphere mm -hmm. what that can do so when i get an email from somebody saying how can you tell what the co2 levels were 800,000 yeah. years ago yeah. you're the one that tells us that yes not me specifically but we get that information mm -hmm. from antarctic ice cores where they actually analyze gas bubbles from okay. 800,000 years ago wow. that were trapped Yes. Now, let's talk about this film. Mm -hmm. um, this is all a focus on caves. Mm -hmm. Where did you get interested in looking at these? Yeah, I started caving when I was 13 and on a family holiday. Wow. wow. And my mom wanted to try it and wanted someone to go with her. Mm -hmm. And I went along and I was really, really hooked. And then I would save up my pocket money and I had a paper round and I would just go caving as much as possible after that. And then it went from there. So we see people uh, rappelling down into a cave. Is that how you g get access to, to a lot of these? Uh, yes, some of them indeed. So it's me that's rappelling in, mm -hmm. in the film okay. quite often. And uh, a few weeks ago, I was doing a 250 feet to have sail, wow. just rappel, just to get into a cave. Um, and others we just walk into or, or row across a lake in a boat or something. Where so. are caves? Anywhere where there's limestone, really. So okay. you can find them on nearly all continents except for Antarctica, actually. Mm -hmm. And in the film, we feature a cave from Minnesota. So oh, cool. We where, some, where is it? Do you remember it's offhand? Spring Valley Caverns in Fillmore County. I cool. Think, okay. That's correct. So we have caves here too. Yes, you do. Yeah, they're beautiful. We know about some of them. Yeah. yeah so yes. we, so go and see them on the big screen first, and then yeah. maybe explore them yourself. Is that open to the public? Definitely. Um, I would suggest joining a caving club, or even hmm. contacting a local grotto, or going to a tourist cave you know that's that's the best way that's way to, to start. start yeah what yeah. is the difference of seeing um, this film on the IMAX mm -hmm. at the Science Museum versus you know in a regular theater oh yeah it's so immersive in the IMAX, especially the Omni mm -hmm. theater here because it comes all the way around you you know and you really feel like you're there so we're kind of in there with you in yeah, that definitely. cave right yeah so yeah, those yeah. are the visuals but the audio is provided by Brian Cranston yeah that's very exciting did you get to yeah. meet him I didn't but I have lots of friends say oh my goodness Brian Cranston said your name. You know? <laughs> that is pretty cool, yeah. <laughs> I can't say that about me. So congratulations on that. And the film looks really, really cool. Yeah, yeah. If you want to see it, Ancient Caves debuts in theaters nationwide on Friday, but you can see it first at the Science Museum of Minnesota this weekend. It will be playing in the Omni Theater through May 24th. You can also meet Dr. Mosley this weekend mm -hmm. as well from noon until 4. Yes. Thank you so much yeah. for coming well, in, for you. being with us. Yeah. So interesting to learn about it.